awesome thing about thieving is that it is an extremely fast skill to train and some of the methods I'm going to show are actually really good money. I was surprised at how good of money making methods there are for thieving uh, considering how fast it is to train. So if you're just starting the game you want a fast skill to train up that can give you some good money making methods, thieving is a pretty good option to go with because it is free to train as well. And this video isn't really for the efficient player because there are better PVM methods than pretty much any money making from any skill. Uh, so this is more for people who want to make money from skills. Maybe they want to train thieving and make money at the same time. They're not too worried about being super efficient. They just like thieving and want to make some money from it or it's their only high skill and they want to see some methods that they can make money from it. So let's get into the top five. So starting our list off in the fifth place, we have RD Knights. These only have a 55 thieving requirement, although I would recommend higher. These don't get to be really good until you have higher thieving. Um, you, you also want to have the full rogues outfit, which doubles your loot while pickpocketing. Um, you also may want to have dodge necklaces, which help while pickpocketing. And also you may want to have the RD Diaries done, which also give a pickpocketing boost. So if you have all those things, if you're in the high 90s of the thieving skill where you don't fail pickpocketing these at all, you can get up to 300k GP per hour pure cash and 250k thieving XP per hour. That is massive, super quick skill to train. And these are pretty AFK. You can just spam click them while watching a movie or TV, although it does take your mouse so you can't do anything else on your computer while you are doing these but they are pretty good for the fifth spot. Next up in slot number four, we have a pretty significant jump in the GP, almost doubling. Uh, so we have Paladins and they are coming in at 500K GP per hour with 171K XP per hour. So less XP, but more GP and recommended to have the same gear as the last one. So you want your full rogue outfit uh, you want some dodgy necklaces and you want to have the RD diaries done so that you get the thieving boost. Um, if you don't have that stuff, that's going to severely hurt how much money you can make off of these. And also these have a 70 thieving requirement and I recommend at least 80 or 90 plus. So that is it for slot number four. Let's get into third place. So for number three, we have another pickpocketing NPC. So coming in at number three, we have the Master Farmer. I'm sure many of us have tried the Master Farmer before and been really annoyed. Maybe getting 53 thieving for Desert Treasure and you hate that place. You hate Master Farmer. But coming in on this list, it comes in at number three. It is up to 840k GP per hour. Crazy, right? And 130k XP per hour. It only requires 38 thieving, although I would recommend... 70 plus and just like the last two you want to have your full rogue outfit you want to have dodgy necklaces you want to have the arty diaries done and uh, you don't need the dodge necklaces if you are 94 plus thieving with the other stuff i mentioned um but yeah if you have all that stuff 840 k gp per hour is crazy that is pretty much all coming from snapdragon seeds ranar seeds and torstal seeds so that wraps up number three. Let's move on to second place. So coming in at second place, we have the rogue chests up in 50 wilderness. So this is a dangerous one. Don't do this if you are scared to lose your stuff. You may lose your loot that you get up there, but it is awesome GP. So it's risk versus reward. It is 950 K GP per hour and 42 K XP per hour. It only has one requirement, which is 84 thieving. And I, I guess also 43 prayer to protect from melee, from the rogues. But other than that, that is it. Every other spot on this list pretty much had other requirements um, like rogues armor or RD diaries. But this basically just 84 thieving and 43 prayer. You can get that on a new account within just a few days if you play a lot. Uh, thieving is extremely fast. So this is an awesome method considering how quick you can get to it. Um, almost one mil an hour. And that is it for our second place. So coming in in first place, we have Pyramid Plunder rushing for Pharaoh Scepters. This is about one mil an hour, so just slightly beating out our last spot. Uh, for this, the only requirement is 21 thieving, although I would recommend probably 81 or 91 thieving to be able to make one mil an hour from this. 
basically what you do is you enter pyramid plunder and you search the sarcophaguses and the chest in the middle of the room and you have a one in 1000 chance of receiving a pharaoh scepter which is worth seven mil sometimes you get scarabs or mummies that spawn from the chest and if those spawn then you don't get a roll on the one in 1000 drop table so really it works out to be a little bit more or a little bit rarer than one in 1000 but you can search 16 you can do 16 searches for every lap in the pyramid plunder and one lap is about four minutes you also get about 75k thieving experience per hour from this so better than the last method as far as xp per hour and that is pretty much it for this video so thank you all for watching i hope it was informative and see you in my next video